Well, look what I've done. I really need to collect more zombie flesh right now. And this one here, this one collection, Wooberdoobs, wasn't enough. Come on, zombie flesh. Portal to the bone recipe from the potato. So I created this other little area down here to uh, collect more zombie flesh. Well, I done fell in. Now, I know that you can upgrade, of course, these zombie minions. But I've noticed that when you do, rather than collecting more zombie flesh, they just collect, like, potatoes and stuff. And I'm just interested in the zombie flesh. So I don't know how useful that really is. And then I also created this. I don't remember why. Oh, I remember why. Pow! Look at all those zombies! Yeah! I, um... created this here basically is a means to jump down to the zombie platform more easily. And to, to get back up, I suppose, is what I did. Oh, yeah, should probably do that. Whoa. Stay in there, boy. Stay in there. Almost there. Come on. Oof. Right a go. Righty yo. Got a potato. Potato. So the idea being that um that skeletons are annoying. Yeah. Knock it off, would you? That I could easily get back up here. See, because otherwise I'd have to use a ladder or something more conventional. And who wants to do that, you know? So I just put this here quick and easy. That zombie almost looked really big or something. Anyhow, so that's what I did. And the reason I'm doing that is because I want this. I will show you. I want to get the small combat sack to begin with. And then I want to get the zombie sword. Look at that. Uh. Just need two zombie hearts and a stick. And the zombie heart is um right before the sword there. Anyhow, and what do we need for that? 32 enchanted rotten flesh. And then to get the enchanted rotten flesh. Oh, we already have this recipe. Just need a whole bunch of zombie flesh. Rotten flesh. So that's my plan. Is to get a uh, more powerful smackaroonadoo. Smackadoo doo. Smack of whacker. Oh, yeah, come on. Wee! That's really the latest addition to the beautifulness of beautiful things. And by the way, let's see if we can do this. What? Woo! Er, got it. No, yes, got it. By the way, this, uh, dark room I built somewhere. Where is it? Straight across here, isn't it? Whee! Oh no, oh no! Well, we'll just get there this way. The dark room I built down here has turned out to oof, not be that effective because stuff doesn't spawn in it when I'm not on the island. Oh, hey, I was looking for one of those. Thank you. You know, if I hung around the island for a while, stuff would spawn in it, sure. 
but when I'm not on the island, stuff doesn't spawn in it, or when I'm not online, stuff doesn't spawn in it. So when I first come back to the game, it's always empty. So it's just not that useful. Not as useful as that zombie island I put together. So look at this. The main hub island. Everything's decorated for Christmas again. That's strange because it's not Christmas. Huh. You know, in the world, there are many different religions. There are some mainstream religions, the more familiar big religions, if the game would stop pausing. And there are some less mainstream religions. One thing that surprises me is that someone hasn't formed a religion based around the toilet yet. I mean... Just think about it. Uh, people spend a lot of their time sitting on the toilets. So I would sort of expect, perhaps, there to be more attention paid to it. Zombie! I'm sure it's perfectly safe to go down this way, see what's here. Oh, it's a fairy soul. Boink. Found one. I guess that's the only thing down here. Can we mine any of this? No, we cannot. Onward to the blazing fortress. It's such a cozy place here. Just take a little jump and miss. Oh, that's lovely. Well, there's some nether wart that I need. Guarded by withery skeletons. Oh, I guess we're going back now. What an adventure! <laughs> 